Friends School are coming here today to look at interdependence and adaptation for their key stage two studies. They'll be doing some pond dipping, some looking underneath logs for invertebrates, looking in trees and bushes, and then lots of games to enforce the ideas of interdependence and also the adaptations of the animals. Once you've found one worm, you need to bring it back and put it in my belly. <laughs> We have been before, uh, we come here because the units are well taught and the kids have fun and they learn a lot. It's nice to see the children working in groups um, and doing things that they can't do in the classroom. You can actually do it as well. um, experience it instead of just like learning about it. In the classroom you talk about it, here you actually get to do it. In an environment like this in the forest, it's very different from the classroom. Uh, you can hear the birds and they get to see all sorts of different things that they can't experience at school. And we do lots of practical work and the kids really enjoy it. We've always got really happy students, very excited, very engaged with the activities that they're doing. Really enjoy the hands-on experience that they get by coming out into the forest and actually finding the animals for themselves and playing the games. The children really enjoy being outside. Uh, it's very different from the classroom. They spend most of the day outside whilst they're here. You have an outdoor classroom. We found four dams of white nymphs and we identified them through the key. Good to come here as a teacher because you can step back and watch the children enjoying what they're doing. You can participate in helping but you're not actually having to organise the lessons. You've got an expert on hand to help if you can't identify things. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to upturn the pot in the middle and the winner will be the first one to reach the outside of the arena. Okay? Come on. You see children interacting in different ways. They're put into groups that they may not normally work with. We are scraping through the leaves to try and find any bugs that live under the leaves. Some of the big bugs live under the logs. Um, away from predators. Learning outside really brings it to life and makes it so much more meaningful to the children. Uh, they take an awful lot home from this, uh, whether it be uh, identification or drama, or teamwork, or just being in this environment. 